Kingston, New York. Kingston is about 20 miles from where we live. We live in what is called a bed and breakfast, which is what most of the little places are. And then they have bigger towns, townships where people commute to work. And this is where we work and really essentially live and do everything. Uh, Kingston, New York, in uh, one of the original 13s of New York. Um, it's about 300 years old, and you're looking at one of the stone buildings that as the beginning of Kingston was built on the hill. It was a part of a fort, which Raymond says they began on a hill. Um, and he's going to come tell you more about it. Okay, Kingston, New York, built in 1651. And this is the Bogardus house, and it's below the corner of the stockade. So this was the Wild West. There's nothing between Kingston and New York and Albany. And everything to the west of us was Indians, mostly Delaware and Iroquois. And on the other side of the river was the Wappingers Indians. And uh, we're going to give you a little tour of some of the old houses. And we'll show you a little bit of the Bogardus house and the corner where the bastion of the stockade was. And it's just like an old Wild West movie stuff. What it looked like. It wasn't anything fancy. Okay, voiceover. Alright, this is the Bogardus house, what's left of it. You can see that they're starting to restore it a little bit. They're putting wood back in the stone uh, walls. And uh, right there, you can kind of get an idea of, uh, of how thick the walls were. And basically, you know, it was like each house was its own little fort. And uh, the street we were on was the bottom of the, the hill and uh, up on this hill where this parking lot is was the corner of the stockade. So uh, basically this is the stockade, what it looked like. Just an old wood stockade. The bastions in the corners here. Uh, that. Uh, Bogardus house was right below the stockade, so it was built outside. And this is what the town of Kingston used to look like. All right, this is the Hoffman house. Uh, it's within the stockade. Uh, you can see it's old Dutch colonial style house. It was built in 1679. And Joan is walking in front of it, and it's now a restaurant that's kind of restored on the inside. You can have uh, lunch and dinner here at the Hoffman House restaurant. Uh, Kingston has a lot of houses that aren't even fixed up. And here's an old stone house. It's uh, got the dormer windows in the roof, and they usually didn't have that, and that's more of a modern addition. But uh, you can see that this was within the stockade, so it's probably one of the original houses. Uh, here's more houses. Still running along the stockade. One of the walls would be behind this house. And there's Joe in front of us. And we're going to go to a little unique spot in Kingston. And we'll come back on when we're there. In the, what would be the middle of the stockade, there's a stone house on four corners, built about 1664. There's no longer a stockade around this town, it's just little bits and pieces. So these houses are restored and they're beautiful and you need to come see them. Um, um, Kingston, New York was the first capital of New York. It is now Albany, which is 60 miles away. And um, the forefathers, including George Washington, fled New York City and was taken over by the British in the Revolutionary War to Kingston. And so we were going to go to the Senate House. They set up the Senate. They have Senate Houses here. They have a place for where George Washington stayed. And we're going to take pictures of that. And you need to come to New York and visit us. Okay. Like Jones said, this is a unique corner in the United States, supposedly, because there's a stone house on all four Corners. So this is a pretty old street corner, as you can see. There's a little bit of details. Uh, houses have shutters on the windows. 
This uh, block of stone that's right there is an old carriage step where you got out of your carriage and stepped down. Uh, the sidewalks are made of blue stone. That was a big industry here in Kingston and the surrounding areas. People cut stone sidewalks. A lot of New York City still has old blue stone sidewalks. And we're at the corner of John and Crown Street, Kingston, New York. And this is, uh, you know, one of the backyards in Kingston behind one of those stone houses on the four corners. They got it nicely set up, a little urban environment. Jones walking towards uh, what was called the Stockade District, which was one of the city centers at one time. And again, four corner stone houses. Very varied architecture for a city that's been 300 years old. You can see the Victorian rooftops there and more modern buildings beyond.